this question is very very important let's go through with the question and even this year model paper also it has been asked okay so in the model paper of 2022 it has also asked so it is very important and easily you can get six marks in this the market demand curve for a commodity and the total cost for a monopoly firm producing the commodity is given by the schedule below use the information to calculate following so based on this information we need to calculate mr and mc schedule quantity for which mr and mc are equal equilibrium quantity of output and the equilibrium price of the commodity total revenue total cost and total profit in equilibrium so let's do this sum as it is quantity and price will write off quantity will write off price will write off from here will write off the total cost as it is will write down the total cost now we need to calculate mr and mc it means to calculate mr we need to calculate total revenue by that only we can calculate marginal revenue and total cost with that help we can calculate mc okay so based on this we'll make line when we for the question as it is we'll write down the quantity price and total cost as it is we'll write down from the question as it is we have written down the quantity price and total cost here you can see when the price is high the quantity demand is less when the price is less the quantity demand is high okay now we have as it is taken down the total cost also now we need to calculate tr so to calculate total revenue we need to multiply quantity into price so price into quantity is equals to total revenue so let's calculate 0 into 52 52 1 sorry it will be 0 anything which is multiplied by 0 it's 0 One forty-four is a forty-four. Two into thirty-six, seventy-two. Three into thirty-one, ninety-three. Twenty-six into four, one not four. Twenty-two into five, one ten. Nineteen into sixteen, one fourteen. Sixteen into seven, one twelve. And eight into thirteen, one not four. Now to calculate MR, we need to take TRN minus TRN minus one. So we don't have any upper. So as it is, forty-four minus zero, forty-four. Seventy-two minus forty-four, seventy-two minus forty-four. Uh. So MR minus uh, T total revenue N minus total revenue N minus one. So seventy two minus forty four twenty eight ninety three minus seventy two um, three minus two one twenty one. Okay. After that we have one not four minus ninety three. Um, it's eleven. Okay. Four minus three one ten minus nine one eleven. Okay, here one ten minus one not four six one fourteen minus one ten four one twelve minus two one not four minus one twelve minus eight. Now we'll calculate MC. So total cost N minus total cost N minus one. Upper we don't have any value. Sixty minus ten, fifty ninety minus sixty, thirty. Hundred minus ninety ten one not two two three four fifteen uh, it's six and ten. By this we have completed the M R N M C schedule. Okay, where the M R N M C schedule is in this. Where the MR and MC schedules, where you can see that MR is also four, MC is also four. So the first answer, what you need to write, the MR and MC, MR and MC schedules at 
the quantity fix what is the second question the quantity for which mr and mc are equal the quantity for which mr and mc is equal is again a sixth quantity the mr and mc is equal mr and mc is equal third question what is it the equilibrium quantity of output and equilibrium price of the commodity so equilibrium quantity is six and equilibrium output is uh, what is mean by output uh, which is total cost okay mm -hmm. quantity of output is six and price equilibrium price is of 19 now another question total revenue total cost and total profit so total revenue total revenue is equals to 114 total cost is equals to 109 to calculate profit we need to minus tr minus tc so 114 is tr minus tc 109 profit is equals to profit is equals to 5 so that is it we have done this is very very important for your six marks by doing this easily you can get your six marks if you found this video helpful do like share and subscribe and thank you so much for watching